My name is Tanis Kefoni and welcome to How to Troubleshoot Error Code 8224 while running LDFD on a Microsoft Exchange Server 2016. I'm recording this video for personal training and it will take about 10 minutes. This video is the best view for a level 1 or a virtual engineer. So, let's start. And I'm starting this video on Exchange 01 in which I'm going to do a fresh and new Microsoft Exchange Server 2016 Cumulative Update 3 installation. As I'm working in my lab with internal traffic, I don't need any kind of malware scanning. And as you can see, no Exchange Server 2010 and 2013 roles have been detected in this topology. And now we are finding that there was an error while running LDFTE to import the schema file. The error code is 8224. So let's troubleshoot the environment. And we are now in this is the one in which you can see three domain controllers connected to each side. The same is for DC02 and the same is for DC03. So I expect that the configuration for the domain controllers is correct. On the computer organizational unit on DC03 you can see that you have Exchange03. On DC02 you have Exchange02. And in DC01, you have Exchange01 and Exchange02. So, we know that we have a replication issue. And now we are going to do a quick overview on Active Directory Sites and Services for DC01, for DC02, And for this is 3 seems to be that the inter-site topology generator was able to identify and automatically generate multiple connections between the three sites. As I'm working on my lab environment, I'm going to change the default replication schedule from 180 minutes to 15. And for to check the correct replication, I've created a couple of users called 855-916-915. And 1002 to verify the correct replication every 15 minutes. And as a final check, I'm going to delete those four users. And I'm waiting for the replication.
You can see now that in this C01, exchange 01, exchange 02, and exchange 03 were fully replicated. And I expect the same for this C02. And for this C03. And now it's time to start again on Exchange 01. Inside 01, our Microsoft Exchange Server 2016 installation. And as you can see, the setup is now in progress. And we are now connected on Exchange 02, Inside 02. And I'm going to execute the get mailbox server command, in which you can see exchange 01, exchange 02, and exchange 03. And we are at the end of this video, so thank you very much for your time, and if you want to be in touch with me, just subscribe on my channel. Bye!